My name is Sherzad. I'm a computer science student in LaGuardia. I'm graduating in spring 21 and um, today I'm gonna show you how to manage your classes in QUniverse. To LaGuardia website, which is laguardia.edu and then under my LaGuardia you click on students. Then your username is uh, your name, that last name and your password is your ample and last two digits of your birth year. Click on login. Then uh, you're on your MyLaguardia page. So then uh, under eTools, you can find QUniverse, you click on it. So your login here is your name, that last name, and the last two digits of your ample. And uh, if you forgot your password, you can easily reset it right here. Then you cl click on Student Center, you click on Enroll, then you select the term, which is Spring 21 in our case. Then you click on Search right here so here the only thing that you should know is a subject and course number so let's take English 101 as an example you type ENG 101 click on search and here we see all of the sections available for this class and um, in this in this column you will see class code here you can see whether the class is regular it means that the class is in long session so session one where it says second session it means that the class is for short term also you can see the days and times and uh, you can observe whether the class is synchronous or asynchronous so the difference is in a synchronous class you are expected to be in an online meetings in this specified time whether in a asynchronous class you don't have your required meetings but you do all of the work online and submit submit it so that's why there are no days and times right here and then you click on select on the class that you want click on next and then class goes to your shopping cart where you can proceed to step 3 and to enroll. You click finish enrolling right here. I'll show you how to drop the class. In your student center, you click on other academic. And you select enrollment drop. You select the term. Then you'll see the list of classes you already enrolled in. So you select the class that you want to drop and click on drop selected classes. And you finish dropping right here. And now I'll show you how to see your class schedule for entire semester. So again under student center, you click on other academic, and you click on class schedule. You select the term and here you will be able to see your class schedule here like all of the classes that you are enrolled in that's it